Hello. Yeah, good day. How are you? Is that Pat? Yeah. Good day, Pat. How are you? It's Roman Blinds here. I'm from <laughs> Collection. All right. Uh, my client, she's approached us to collect the money for that rug that uh, apparently you sold her a rug. The rug was a dud. Oh, that's funny. It she... was perfectly clean when I gave it to her. My sister-in-law rolled it up. Yeah, but there was Pat... was not a mark on it. And uh, then she sent it back with reckoned it had... She uh, wants the money back, Pat. Burns in it. And when we... Margaret bought it back. She's got us in here, Pat, to get the money back. She wants the $20. She's and, and and the... bloody $20. Well, it's not, just, it's not just It's not just the money. It's it, for no, the... No, it's not with me either. That's why I said... It's not right. just some money for the rug, she Pat. Left, she left that mat rolled up from... How could you do that to her? I don't normally... Did it. I don't, don't normally and get in... And when she rolled it undone... She you don't listen, do you? You don't listen, do you? rubbed it with the... You're not hearing a bloody thing I'm saying, are you? Hey? You're not hearing a thing I'm saying. You're not no, listening. I'm sorry. Yeah. Yeah, right now? Yeah. Well, you tell me what's going on. Well, I had a white mat in the lounge room. And yeah. It was t- we had to walk all around. The dog around came in, crapped on it. And in the finish, I said to Margaret... Santa said, Claus Lord, come down the chimney. See if Pat wants to buy this rug, or this mat. I said, I'm sticking it. Anyway, a monkey jumped on the roof. And anyway, she rang Pat, hit from here. So I took my clothes off. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> Pat said, yes, I'll have it, yeah. without even seeing it. And then we so, went, course, did our business on the floor. Margaret rolled it up, and it never had any marks yeah. on it. Yeah, and we were going anyway, hard. And it still rolled up over there. So the anyway. So when she did unroll it... There was a said, snow on the mountain. Margaret, she said, I'm not very happy with it. Then what happened? Said, hey? What happened then? She said, oh, it's got cigarette burns in it. Oh, yeah. Margaret so I took my clothes off again. rolled it up, and Margaret said... Pat Police said, came around. Didn't have any rope, and, uh, any marks. Uh, and when ooh, I the siren went... Are you listening? Yeah, I'm listening. Yeah, yeah. And um, anyway, uh, I said, well, let her bring it back. So yeah. Margaret brought it back. And anyway, the sun was here, and we unrolled it on the legs. floor. Mm. And we got a damn She had a bikini line and done. And all the marks started to come off. They were yeah. coffee or cocoa or Brazilian something. it was. Yeah. And they weren't burned at all. So what happened was... Yeah. So I was so wild, I yeah. didn't know that Matt never left. I anyway, offered anyone an antelope that. jumped on the three gorillas there were. No, are you listening? So, I don't want that 20 bucks, I want the cost. Oh, I'll give her the $20. It's not just the want. $20. How could you do that to the woman? Why'd you do it? I beg your pardon. Why that did you do it? It was spotless when it left Oh, here. it wasn't and spotless. It, oh, yes, it was. And she said no, they were Pat, it wasn't burnt. spotless. She said they were spotless. Spots, it had, spots on it had more though. spots on it than a my leopard. My sister in law rolled that mat up. That spot because this, got this spot, the that spot, the dog. And my sister rolled that up. There was a spot up, that went down. I had a spot. I went to the doctor about it. I would never have Anyway, that cleaned up after a while. Are you listening to me? Yeah, I am listening to you. my side of it, will you please? Yeah, all right. Will you tell when me? I, when I rolled that mat up, or my sister in law yeah, rolled that mat up, there wasn't a mark. Apparently, on. it was an infection. I would, listen. I would never have offered anyone to that penicillin. to be in that state. It's back here and now, and it is filthy. Anyway, but it wasn't in like the end, he said, left here. it'll go away after three but months. She's the, she's the sort of and after three months, we just stopped it. God's sake. What? She didn't open the bloody thing till a fortnight ago. Yeah. And then complained about all the oh, marks on it. Yeah, I know, 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 you've gone on and on and on and on about it, Pat. Well, that mat was yes. not like that when it left here, and my sister and oh, I knows it. You can't expect to do that when there's a Sherpa carrying a bag down a Himalayan mountain. Well, why didn't she... Why didn't she... Un- as I said to Margaret, why didn't yeah. she undo it and show it to us? There were only three had- bodies that we dug up in the backyard. Listen. Yeah. I said to Margaret, why didn't you open mm-hmm. the mat when you took it to Pat? Then if I rang the police. Dirty, she would have seen Yeah, it. and they came straight round. But they didn't. She and that's it and how it happened. We got divorced three years ago. She stood in the corner for three months oh, before she, she got the house. I got the kids. Uh, who are you? I'm working. I'm, I'm Raymond Blinds. I'm from the collection. Well, I'll tell you what, mate. I'm not the type of person to sell anybody a thing that was filthy, dirty uh, like that. Are you the sort of person, though, Pat, to get caught in a crazy call? Oh, you say that again. <laughs> she can have a bloody $20 check. Hey, Pat. Check. Pat. She, are you the sort of person to get caught on a crazy call? You've been caught on a crazy call set up by Vera? That's the sister-in-law I'm talking about. We don't call her Vera, we call her Margaret. Margaret. She took the mat from here. Yeah, she I know. She's the one that rolled it up. She, she knows there was no dirty on, she does. on it. She does, and she's got you caught on a crazy call. She can have a $20 back. No, nah, hey, hey, I've Pat, got the mat back now. Hey, it's Pat, gonna cost, it's going to cost me that much to get the bloody thing shampooed again. Pat. To get it clean. Pat. Hello? It's, it's Dave Noonan from, from Heart 107. Mm. 
You know Vera, yeah. she's she's caught you on a crazy call. Well, what does she bloody will stick her nose in for? She knows. No, well, she she can just. She, she bloody knows she was the one that rolled the yeah, and that up. Uh, she knows. And she knows bloody well that it was clean. Well, I don't feel like giving her the $20 don't. back. It's going to cost me that to get the bloody thing clean. And it wasn't cigarette marks at all. My son got a, a cloth and wiped it and they were coffee or cocoa or something. Yeah.